What's up, guys? This is Brian from Allen Knife and Cigar and WhoCouldMain.com. Abby from WhoCouldMain.com. And Jake with WhoCouldMain.com. Today we are reviewing Sinbad Tropicana Sour Fruit Mix. Like Abby said, we're reviewing Sinbad's Tropicana Fruit. Um, this is one of the flavors that Sinbad was nice enough to hook us up with when we were in California a couple months ago. Um, and this is probably one of the best flavors that we actually received, and as you can, as you can see... Besides Maryland's Cherry. Next to Maryland's Shh. Cherry. As you can see, it's empty. Nothing in there except for some juice, because the stuff is juicy. But you can get a close-up of the can here. Um, we know Finny and Time Lord, and um, Jason actually just shot a review of this um, today as well, so it's kind of ironic they were doing the same one, but... I guess two opinions don't hurt, especially if they're contributing to uh, helping you guys know what's the good stuff out there. Um, about the cut, it's your typical Sinbad cut. Very red, very moist, very drippy. Um, very, very, very juicy tobacco. We're smoking out of a KM Tri-Metal hookah, <coughs> excuse me, with a uh, Namor hose, wind cover, aluminum foil, funnel bowl, three coconut coals. Um, as far as the smell goes, it smells just like it's, you know, tro called Tropicana Sour Fruit, and it definitely smells like a sour fruit. I'm smelling like a kiwi and like a like sour apple, and you know, on the actual picture, the picture they show grapes and bananas and cherries and strawberries and things like that and oranges. But I'm not really smelling any of that. But it, I'm getting like a sour fruit sweet smell out of this. Can I talk a little bit about the smell of that? Yeah, it smells like a big mix of fruit. Yeah, but it has a sour touch to it too. Sour candy. Yeah, it's a bunch of sour fruit that is it's fucking good. Oh yeah. Yeah, it's it's just really, really good. <laughs> yeah. I love that shit. Um, as far as this taste, I mean, it tastes just like it smells. It just tastes really, really, really good. And it's it's. It's very flavorful, but at the same time, it's mild. It's not, you know, overwhelming. It doesn't make you sick, you know, of it really fast like a lot of shishas tend to do. Um, pull a quick drag on it and give you a little more detail. I'm definitely tasting like an orange taste. I'm tasting like strawberry. Um, but again, it's like... It's hard to describe what that sour is there. I don't know if it's like a very strong like sour apple and then you're getting the rest of the fruits or you're getting a really strong lemon and you're getting the rest of the fruits, but you're getting a very citrusy sour taste in there with all the fruits. Um, I know that you guys, or you guys know that I'm a big fan of the fruit roll-up from Sinbad and this is very, very close to the fruit roll-up taste, just a little more on the sour side. So picture fruit roll-up but sour. Um, fruit roll-up is actually a fruit mix is what it is. It's a fruit mix and that's the actual flavor of the fruit roll-up. And this is a Tropicana is a sour fruit mix. So if you put two and two together, it's basically a sour fruit roll-up. Um, you want to talk a little bit about the taste? We also are using a diffuser on this as well, so we're getting some really uh, even smoke out of this. It's good. It's very sour to me. I don't know. It's good. And it's also pretty it's sweet as well. I mean, it does have um, definitely sweet, sweet properties. Um, and it is... Uh, you know, very mild at the same time. It's 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 flavorful, but again, it's again like I said earlier, it's not overwhelming. You know what it tastes like? What? Nerds. That's, really? that's a good idea. You know, when you eat the nerd nerds. candies and you get that sour, that sour taste with the nerd candies. That's a good point. Very good point. Maybe you take a handful of the nerds and you eat them all at once. Mm -hmm. Nerd candies. I know we do not own trademark the nerds. That'd be Willy Wonka. As far as the smoke goes on this, as you can just see, Brian put out some pretty fat, white, puffy cloud out of this. Oh, Let's yeah. see what I can get out of this. <coughs> just very, very soft clouds. They're not... I mean, when I say soft, I mean they're just very thin, but at the same time, they're very full. Uh, full clouds. Um, we got the fan going, too. We do have the fan going. We also... Um, this is our second set of coals on here as well. Um, but it is still putting out just as much taste as it was before when we first started. You know, um, I would smoke this out of a KM, I would smoke this out of a Layla, I would smoke this out of pretty much any hookah that I have, and I'd smoke it any time. I'd even smoke this out of a uh, shoe. <laughs> you know, going back to uh, old, old Greg. Greg. Old Greg. 
Fuzzy Beach Man. Fuzzy Beach as as Man. As far as an overall uh, rating on this, I'm going to go ahead and talk a little bit about the buzz. There's really no buzz, non existent. Sinbad. Um, they have very little nick. Very little nicotine. It's a. It says 0.3%, but what they mean is 0.03%. I actually talked to, um, you know, talked to Sinbad when I was there, and, and they did tell me that that was a typo. It was actually 0.03%. So it's one of the smallest amounts of nicotine um, that's on the market. And they say tar is 0.9% or 0.0%, which again, it's kind of in a way it's wrong because anything that's burned is going to release a small amount of tar. Thankfully, the, the the water filters it out. But it is a very very low nicotine product, so there's no buzz involved. As far as an overall scale, what are you thinking? I would go with a nine. It's my favorite Sinbad. What do you think? Far. Nine is good. I was gonna say nine out of ten as well. So I mean, that's uh, that's definitely a good way way to you know place a score of this because it is a very good flavor. Um, I know the Shisha Nazis gave it something a little lower, but I mean for them that's a really good score. Uh, for me, I tend to you know vote a lot of Shishas a little on the high side. Um, that's why it's always good every now and then to have a few people reviewing with me to give you more of a medium score. Um, but a 9 out of 10, and this has been Sinbad's Tropicana Sour Fruit Mix. This has been Jake. Abby. And I'm Brian. With WhoGoodMain.com. And until next time, you guys keep smoking.